uh, good agricultural practices, the global standards. These global standards, both in aqua as well as agriculture sector, we require your help to come forward. We would work together so that our standards improve, so that we are globally competitive as well. So that you know we help each other in a, in a big way, be it agriculture, be it uh, uh, the marine part of it. Uh, productivity is one other area where you know we have ample we have ample land, but I was just discussing with uh, uh, Harish the other day, and uh, these are the things what uh, needs improvement. For instance, we have coffee, where uh, per acre yield in coffee of ours is 250 kgs, and uh, in Vietnam, I was told, is seven to eight tons. 7,000 kgs to 8,000 kgs is what I was told. You know, these kind of innovation, innovatives, innovative practices to improve productivity and yield, this would be something what we would also love to collaborate on. And then we have uh, opportunities exist in uh, seaports, investment could be sought, airports, Investment could be sought. Refineries, investments could investments could be sought. Steel projects, investment could be could be sought. And uh, water management investment could be sought. Mobilization of financial resources for the state would be one important area where we could come along in a very big way. Projects such as interlinking of, what, interlinking of rivers. We have a situation where we are the fag end state, we are the tail end state. So we have a situation where uh, interlinking of rivers are, is a very essential part to stabilize this agrarian economy. We have a situation where uh, we need your help there to interlink uh, Godavari to Krishna, where to stabilize the water needs there, where both of us can come together in a very big way.